Tenemos a Eddie Larty, Canadá. Slam poetry is an art form unlike any other, one that Eddie Larty has come to master. When you're sandwiched between nightmares and nightlife, every toast becomes a prayer. Winning an international poetry slam competition in Brazil against 13 other poets. Stories of love and, and of triumph and of glory um, are all universal, so thank you so much for sharing that amazing. Where I get to report on the things that are happening in front of me, I get to dictate and I get a, a spotlight that's that's placed on me but i get to to showcase it on the things that's happening around me larty built on the momentum he gained from winning the canadian poetry slam in the spring on the strength of poems like this one called gentrification there's a catholic church being remade in the image of a condo a hungry collection plate an overdue light bill residents, residents drown, drown in both debt, debt and baptism the church was built on top of a graveyard and even here the ghost can no longer afford to rest in peace at the Brazil Championship, his wordsmithing even cut across a language divide. It was interpreted in American Sign Language, captioned in English, Portuguese, and Spanish. An artist who's considered a love poet, transcending boundaries. I'm always trying to make people feel good and, and pe make people feel loved and connected to whatever their purpose is. Larty's success could also mean greater exposure for slam poetry. There's no hate language. Um, you have three minutes and ten seconds, no props, no musical instruments, except for the sounds your body can make, um, all original work. Original work that Eddie Larty hopes to see more of in Canada. Strong enough to hold a cup, and know the cup has no hold on me. Eddie Larty de Canada. Ross Lord, Global News.